Hi, hello friends. Welcome to English with Mr. Nambi. In this video, we are going to learn about Class 9th Unit 4 poem, The Spider and the Fly, written by Mary Botham Howitt. Poet Mary Botham Howitt is an English poet and she is educated at home and she has written many verses and she has written 180 books. This poem is about the conversation between the spider and the fly and how the spider tempted the fly and how it had eaten the fly at last. Friends, let's look into the summary of this particular poem. Poet begins the poem with the statings of the spider. The spider is asking the fly, Will you come to my parlor? Spider started to describe about the parlor. It says that the parlor is quite pretty and on the way to the parlor there is a winding stair and there were many curious things that are to show to the fly if it visits the spider's parlor. Fly replied no and the fly also says that asking to her is useless and it also says that it knows that whoever who goes to the winding stair will not return back. Again the spider tempted the fly by stating that it was very tired by flying high and the spider also says that the fly can rest on his bed and the beds are with pretty curtains. Again the fly replied as no and it gives a reason for that no. It says that whoever sleep in the spider's bed will not wake up. The spider also says dear friend what can I do to show you my affection. The spider is also showing the pantry and it describes about it and will you take a slice from my pantry? The fly replied that it don't wish to see its pantry. The spider again tempts by stating that you are a sweetest creature and you are clever, wise and you have done handsome thin wings and you have the brilliant eye and it also says that it has a glass for the fly and if the fly visit its parlor it will give it to the fly the fly said thank you for the praising and the next day it says the good morning and it says that it will come on another day and the spider went to the den and wait for the fly to come back and the spider oh a subtle web and ready to dine the fly the spider comes to the door again and it started to sing about the fly it says that you have a pearl and a silver wings and your clothes are green and purple and you have a crest upon your head and diamond eyes but mine is lit. Degrading its beauty by saying that the fly is so beautiful than him. Fly after hearing the song comes slowly to the spider and it started to hear the flattery words and it made the fly to think that it has all the qualities like brilliant eyes, green and purple color and crested head. Finally, it came to the spider like a fool. And then the spider jumped on the fly and dragged it to the winding star and it took it to his den. The fly never came back. It was dined by the spider. The spider eat the fly and it never came out. Through this poem, the poet is advising the reader that Dear little children, that we should not pay attention to the flattery words and we should not fall for that. Poet also says that if you are listening to the words of evil counselor, you should close your heart, ear and eye. This tale gives a beautiful lesson to the readers that we should not pay attention to the flattery words which will make us to suffer like the fly died because of the spider's flattery word. Thank you so much friends for watching.